thank you. This is the image we intend to use to portray our new Siri products. As you can see, here is the Apple family on a breakfast table enjoying her products. The very good thing about this product is that it is rich in fiber and highly nutritious. But what do you guys think about that? It's good. It's nice. It's good. Mom has a consumable product. I think it's a nice concept. Mm -hmm. Yes, I believe this is a strong idea. It's very beautiful. Looking at the image, it clearly shows that it is family friendly. Yes. And I see the kids smiling. It just shows that it is something consumable by all ages. So I think we should go for it. I really like the idea. Yeah, it's actually a beautiful idea and it's quite innovative. I must say kudos to the team. Thank you. Stella. 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 Wow. Stella. I'm distracted. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Stella, is everything fine? Don't take it easy, don't hang Stella, are you okay? Please come up. Growing up, my dad was always brutal, assaulted my mom repeatedly, and always battered her at the slightest provocation. She would cry and cry and cry. And if any of us dared raise our voices to attract the neighbors or attempt to call for help, he would hit us real hard. It was really bad. I mean, we dare not interfere. <laughs> I was just nine and my sister seven. My dad was always seeking out opportunity to exhibit his masculinity with all amount of brutality simply because he said my mom could not give him a male child. One day at dinner, he was at it again. And this time, another flimsy excuse as usual that mom served him a cold food as he motioned towards her with his belt. She tried running upstairs to escape, but he pulled her back and she fell badly. And she bled to death. She was eight months pregnant. She never made it. Our dad threatened us never to tell anyone. The memory of seeing her bleed to death still haunts me to today, especially when I see a family seated together happily. This was my story. You see, each time I see an image or a happy family together, it triggers the memories. <laughs> the worst of it is, watch my mother died oh in the pool of her own blood over a meal. My dad said it was cold. Stella, it's okay, please. I understand. It's okay. Look at the sky, God. I go from all that. It's, it's okay. I understand everything. Just the fine. Please. Just the fine. Gender-based violence is a gross violation of human rights and can lead to physical or emotional injury with immediate and long-term consequences, including post-traumatic stress disorder or even death. Victims of violence endure worse things and need all the support they can get. You can refer them for psychosocial support and trauma counseling. Report cases of gender-based violence now. Break the culture of silence. Download the Talkham app on Play Store. You can also visit www.talkham.org slash report and www.naptip.gov.ng. Call 627 or 070-300-00203 or 
0800-2362. This message is brought to you by Devatop Center for Africa Development in collaboration with the National Agency for the Prohibition of Trafficking in Persons, NAPTIP, under the TOKAM project funded by the U.S. Embassy in Nigeria, Asian Contra La Trata, and Paplona City.